evening, fellow Toastmasters and all the guests present here. So if you want to ask me a sentence, I'll just say that what is water to the body? That's the importance of education to the development of a human being. Coming to the, to, to the table topic session, let me just quickly tell you what this session is about for those guests who are in here. So this table topic session, the purpose of this session is to facilitate table topics where guests and members will have the opportunity to practice their impromptu speaking. Now, due to the short of time, I have something in different than the normal topics that have been conducted. It's called storytelling, but in a different style. And I will request the timers to please take note of this timing criteria that will be coming on the screen. And I will request the speakers as well to take note of it. I will request, since we have got members and guests online as well as offline, I will need three volunteers from the online platform and two from the offline or the physical platform there, because I can't see the people there. I believe most of the role players have got the opportunity. If not, I will call them the names. So if I can have raise of hands of three online members and if someone over there in the physical area can volunteer, two of them. All right. Seeing none. Jyoti has put up her hands in the online mode. All right. And evaluator Sai also has put up. All right. So we have got the three of them online. So we've got Toastmaster Jyoti. We have got Toastmaster Sai. Toastmaster Sri Panu. And from the physical platform, who is willing to take up this role? Guess evaluator are... to Sai also on raise hand. Evaluator to Sai on raise hand yes. from online. Done. I've taken three. Of them. Can I call if possible to if the guest Karthik, if you are comfortable to take this role, is very easy. If you would like, I will give you a good opportunity. Yeah. Yes, sir. Uh, Karthik uh, is very for uh, table talking. Fantastic. Can I call them to? Manasri in the physical platform. Toastmaster Manasri. Yeah. Uh, Toast, distinct Toastmaster, can I see Toastmaster Manasri as well? <laughs> okay. So this is how I will just share you my screen. Thank you so much. I'll just share you my screen quickly. So it'll be for all of you to know what is the rules of this story set. And here we go. All right. Timers, the offline and online timers, please take note of this. Since we're going to have a very short time left for the session, you will have the green virtual background or the green card at 40 seconds. The yellow virtual background or the yellow card will be shown at 50 seconds and at one minute or 60 seconds, we will have the red virtual background or the red card shown for the offline participants. Okay, so I hope the timing criteria is clear for both the timers and for all the participants as well. Now, how does this work? Okay, my math is not right today. It's five participants. We'll have three online, which is Toastmaster Jyoti will be the first, followed by Toastmaster Sai, the second, followed by Toastmaster Sri Panu will be the third. And then the two offline, we will have first Karthik will speak, and the last will be Toastmaster Manasvi. Okay, so that is the order of speaking. Okay, now in the story, presenting before you a situation, you all will understand the situation and then based on your creativity, you can create a story from that. And when one speaker finishes his or her part within that one minute, 
the next speaker will continue from that story. And Toastmaster Manasvi, you are the last person, so you will end the story. We have Toastmaster Jyoti who will start. I'll give the situation. Toastmaster Jyoti will start and continue the story till Toastmaster Manasvi ends it. Okay, so I hope the friends are clear. You story, but each of you have one minute and make sure your story continues from the next person. All right. And this is your okay. So this is your situation. All five of you, five of you are in a class, and the teacher is taking a science-related subject on rockets and space. Okay. The teacher is called by the principal for an urgent meeting and the teacher appoints a class leader in charge for, the meet, for that time. The teacher comes back after 15 minutes and what she sees is you standing on the table and you then realized that the teacher is behind you. The teacher asks you, what are you doing? So this is the situation. I hope it is clear. The teacher was taking a science class. The teacher is called for a meeting by the principal and appoints a class leader. For 15 minutes, Teacher is not there, teacher comes back, and what she sees is you standing on that table as you see on the screen, and she's asking you for an explanation. Now you will need to build your story from here. So let me call first Toastmaster Jyoti. You can start your one minute, we'll start now. Let me stop the share. Toastmaster Jyoti. Toastmaster Jyoti, your mic is muted. If you could unmute. I'm so sorry. I was only doing a practical session of what you taught. Can you see I have this? And I was making this awesome rocket to go. Little did I realize that it would get stuck in the fan there. I had to climb up. Am I correct? You can ask everybody in the class. That's exactly what I did. I had no intentions of breaking anything else. If you notice, I've got a stack of paper just to make sure. And you know, you walked in. But that friend of mine, he made a noise and I had to jump up to bring it down. And you walked in and you think I did something wrong. I would never disobey you, ma'am. Thank you so much, Jyoti. Now, let me call the next speaker, Toastmaster Sai, to continue from there. Jyoti, you don't even go to the school. You graduated 24 years ago. Why are you in this classroom? And what is this obsession with this particular lecture that brings you back to this classroom every year on this day? You're not even a science student. You were an artist when I last checked. I follow you on Instagram. I see your paintings and your sketches. What is it about rockets and space that attracts you so much? If you really want it, go talk to Elon Musk. He can maybe send you or put you on a spaceship and send you off to Mars. Though I'm sure that on the 6th of January every year, you will find a way back to my classroom to stand up on my desk when suddenly, I don't know how you manage this, but I get called away for an emergency meeting every year. I'll, I'll come back and find you standing on the, on the desk, holding up your arms as if you're praying to a space god. And then tell me that your airplane was or your rocket was stuck in the fan. Jyoti, Thank you. it's well time, it's past time for you to stop doing this. 
Thank you, just press aside. Now our third speaker will continue the story from here that we call Toastmasters 3.0 bus. Over to you. I think this is the second time I have seen Jyoti in this class doing creating another ruckus. Although I do enjoy the sessions that she has with the teacher. Uh, I, I can attest to the fact that she did not break anything. But yes, she does like jumping around the desk. And uh, yes, she also has, uh, I like what she brings to the table, uh, an artistic mind as well as a passion for science, because again, this is the second class of science that she has come to attend. And uh, what better than a practical display of uh, flying uh, planes and uh, trying to catch a rocket than in a rocket class. So I'm glad that she was here. Although I would ask you to be wary of Sai the next time. Thank you, Toastmaster Sriparna. Sriparna? Sriparna? Sorry. Sriparna. Yeah. Okay. Now, our fourth speaker, our guest, Karthik, will continue the story from there. Over to you, Karthik. So, we actually are not there in the class at that time. So, that's why I'm actually I'm like, uh, I'm flying in the sky and I'm Counting the stars and <laughs> Thank All right. Thank you, Karthik. Now we have Toastmaster Manasvi who will end the story. Over to you, Toastmaster Manasvi. Teacher, actually, I was trying to explain to everyone, but then Jyoti stand up on the desk and she was measuring the size of the moon <laughs> with her hands and she was trying like, okay, this big is the moon and we have to reach over there. So that is the thing happens and then immediately I went up to the Karthi, Karthi, why you are sleeping? Wake up from your dreams of the stars and the galaxies and, uh, the, uh, and about this uh, galaxies and the universe. Come to the real classroom and see how Jyoti is depicting the rocket which is reaching towards the moon. So, uh, teacher, I, I hope that this is the motto of this class, that like you are teaching us how to reach to the moon and how to reach our dreams over there in the universe, which is infinite. So, hopefully, I think teacher is uh, now well aware of what Jyoti was doing, and uh, we explain our rules very well. Thank you, Riti, over and all. Can we all give a round of applause to all the table topic speakers, wonderful storytellers, and I'm sure this has been a learning experience for each and every one of us. And I hope this creativity continues in the meetings ahead as well. Thank you. And let me call the timer.